software evolution. So in this session, let us define what is software evolution. So the process of developing a software product using software engineering principles, procedures and methods is referred to as software evolution. We know that whenever a particular software will be developed for a specific application or purpose, then it will be known as a software product. And here we will be using engineering well tested principles, procedures and method in the development process. This includes the initial development of software and its maintenance and updates till desired software product is developed which, is, which, which will satisfy the expected requirements. So we know that at the beginning we shall ask the respective stakeholders regarding their expectations and requirements from the software and this software development will not get terminated until all those requirements and expectations are getting implemented. Evolution starts from the requirement gathering process and after which developers create a prototype of the intended software and show it to the user to get their feedback at the early stage of the software product development. So at first we might be creating one prototype of the software where prime functionalities will get implemented and we shall demonstrate that prototype to the client and if the client is saying yes it is in the right track then then we will be proceeding otherwise depending upon the feedback the respective changes are to be done on the prototype. Okay. Next one is that the user suggests changes on which several consecutive updates and maintenance keep on changing too. The user will suggest some changes may suggest some updates and those changes and updates are to be reflected on our developed version. This process changes to the original software till the desired software is getting accomplished. Even after the user has the desired software in hand, the advancing technology and the changing requirement force the software product to change accordingly. So now to recreate software from the very scratch and go to one to one with the requirement is not feasible. So you know that in the present scenario, the different technologies are coming and as a result of that the pre-existing software might be requiring some changes and developing that software with the new requirements from the very scratch may not be feasible. So it might be costing a to it will be involving a long budget a huge budget for that. So that is why creating a software from the very scratch is not feasible. So what will happen the only feasible and economical solution is to update the existing software so that it matches the latest requirements and the advancements. So in this way we have discussed that what is software evolution and how the different operations and actions are taking place in software evolution process. Thanks for watching this video. Tutorialspoint.com simply easy learning.